I'm standing in front of a little trick puzzle. Where despite the fireman's visible, it looks like the fire has yet to be contained. Oh no, some people are still stuck inside? Kids, we need to evacuate the building quickly and calmly. Let's get moving. Ryan, let's go! Ryan, come on! We have to go! Now! What about my mom? I'm sure one of our staff will be taking good care of her. But as of right now, we really need to go. I'm afraid this might stay a little long. Sophia, please stick with me. I need to go. We can see people are starting to make their way outside. We can only hope that everyone. I'm not sure what's happening now. Here's someone is trying to get into the hospital? I cannot get any closer, Allison. You have to jump now. The flame is getting higher. I need to pull out. For the new week, it's gonna be pretty great. Whoa! I know the new patriotic department looking hot, right? A hot drop for a smoking hot doctor. Oh, a smoking hot doctor. Can you introduce us at the party tomorrow? Although I can I cannot say that now that we're dating. Yes. Yes you do. There you go. Mom Do you wanna get some ice cream? Got the best mommy in the whole world. You can listen. Perfect. So, how did I do? My first day back in pediatrics? It did amazing. Although, although I guess I kind of have to say that now. That we are dating. I guess I deserve that. 
Oh, I got to something. As it's your first day here. Doctor changed terrible me. To the first of many great days. Allison, are you ready to help us set up the party? My girls, all together! This is going to be so much fun! Do you think we will survive without me? I guess I will have to manage somehow. I will save you a dance. You better! You and me today, princess. You are right, this party is awesome. Told ya. Finally, everything is perfect. Allison! It's, it's your mother! Uh, you have to take it here. She's ill. She's being moved to the hospital as we speak. Mom? Don't call on her again. Elsa, are you sure about this? Yes, I'm sure. Right now, it's late and I need to get some sleep. I will walk you out. I don't know what's going on, but this is a hospital. I'm sure you have important work to get to, so why don't you go to your office? And as for you, why don't you start examining this boy? He's been vomiting all day! 
that's still what you do, right? Allison, can you keep... feeling much better. Thanks. That's a great news, right? And how are you? How do you think I am? You did not have to kiss him back, you know? I pushed him away and told him you and I were together. Took you long enough. You're being unreasonable, Connor. I have a lot of my mind now, my mom's suddenly here. But if it will make you feel better, I will talk to him. Daniel was not here. No, been here the whole time. He's very busy. We'll have to continue this conversation later, Allison. But for now, just know that I'm sorry. Please, let Connor know to you. Now, what can I do for you and the board, Fictor? You can tell me what the heck has been going on in this hospital. Rumors have been flying around. The intern performing operation by herself, medicine disappearing, the head of a hospital vanishing without trace. Nothing but rumors. I mean, I'm standing right here. But if the boards get worried, feel free to look around. I was hoping you say that. How did it go? It's really sorry, Connor. He told me to tell you that just before our conversation got struck by Victor. Victor? That means something is up. Both members never come down here. Thanks for talking to Daniel, Allison. Let's get back to work. Daniel is called a staff meeting in the hall. And that is why we are currently under audit. Please provide his Victor and his son Mason with anything they might need. After all, we have got nothing to hide. Thank you. How did? How exciting! You're an odd girl, Jenny. <laughs> Can you? You and I both know that we do have something to hide. I'm sorry, I was 
It's a color. It's a color. Look at my mask. Doesn't it look great? Right and help. Whoa, Jewel, that looks fantastic. You're going to make an awesome wrestler. What's going on here? I thought we could use the distraction, so I organized a play with the kid. Let's just start making a custom. It's called Superhero Wrestle 4 The Wrestling. I even got Ryan to join in as well. You're still out on that one, McCoy. Shut up, it's Super Ryan. Guess I better help. Enter, enter, please, take a seat. This is here still free. Honey, this is here are still free. No, my mom is sitting there. Oh, I'm sorry. Honey, I'm afraid I don't think your mother is coming. Don't let you know let those people sit there. Again. Your mother has not called or sent a letter in years. You I swear you know. She probably me. Here. Where have you been? When I first started to bell, she told me that when I passed Why my friend and said she would be there. She got her old bell off it and we took the picture together. Disappear I mean, like you she will be here. Need an hour like I do. Then I may be older now, but I still. I haven't lived cause I wasted my time standing in the crowd for a face I never found, I never found. You did amazing! So, your parents did not show up? No surprise then. I did not even invite them. They have their own things to worry about. No need. I can take care of myself. But still, you did a great job helping the little kids today. here to pick up every file from 2000 until now. Um, did we have an appointment? The board doesn't need appointment. The files? As you can see, we are pretty busy, but I might be able to get them for you by tomorrow evening. Evening? I couldn't have up. It's not like I've got anything better to do. Thanks, Ryan. Then Mason will pick them up tomorrow morning. So, Victor is a pretty calm and collected guy, isn't he? Thanks again, Ryan. Whoa, Ryan, those are all the files we need. Now we just need to go through them to check that everything is there. Again, I got nothing better to do here. Guess we are working well right together then. I love to help out, but Victor wanted to talk to me. Don't get any ideas, Ryan. I'm watching you. Well, right? 
Well, then that's something we both have in common. Moms. Moms. Actually, the hospital food isn't all that bad compared to my mom's cooking. Okay, Ryan. I also felt my connection in the kitchen and made me an extra pudding. Okay, thanks, Allison. You are awesome. What's up with him? Don't know. He's been extra moldy all morning. <laughs> all this stuff. Ah! Ryan, what's going on? It's all his toys. They're so long. I don't think this has anything to do with toys. It's my mom. The doctor just told us it's not looking good. My complaints with my mom and we might fight a lot. This is still my mom. Still the one that take care of me. And bad things happen. Honey, I can't even say that I heard. Mom! Where should that? Is he with the doctors? Yeah. 
Oh, we can transfer it now. I killed her. <laughs> Organ transplant? Is it? You need an organ transplant for me. So the only reason you came to this hospital to me is because you did something for me? Allison, that's not true. Stop, please. Tell me, would you have looked me up otherwise? Mom, Allison, I thought you finally wanted to get to know me. I do. Ladies, this is going to have to wait. Right? Right? Are you okay? Talk to me. Don't worry, Matilda. He's in a hospital. And hospitals are the safest place in the world. Thank you.